Hi guys and welcome to my channel. We are going to be watching Lost Season 1 Episode 9 and this one is called Solitary. If you guys would like to follow me on Twitter or would like early access to my reactions or would like to watch the full reactions that are up on my Patreon, the link will be down below. Let's get into this episode. Oh, shit. <gasps> uh. Everybody's way tense. Dude, I'm just saying, it'd, it'd be sweet if we could have, I don't know, something to do. And that's my main concern, is keeping us alive. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Is that the girl in the photo? I'm a survivor of a plane crash. I found a wire on the beach. I followed it. I, th I thought it might have something to do with the transmission we picked up on our receiver. With a Frenchwoman repeating on a loop for 16 years. Is that her? Sixteen years. Has it really been that long? Happen to hear my distress call? I know what you are. Well, I think it's safe to say she's the one that hit him. But why didn't she take him prisoner before? from somewhere else but they control it now they who they. you and the others like you i am not say it how do you know my, my name was on a jacket yours is on the envelope you carry the woman in the photographs If you refuse to cooperate, I'm going to hurt you. Do you understand? Nobody calls me Noor Said. Does he know her? You don't remember me? Am I so different from the little girl in the schoolyard who used to push you in the mud? Tell me or I swear I will hurt you. Oh, I know, Said. This is not my first interrogation by the Republican Guard. This is where they burned me with acid. They pierced my hands with a drill. Would you like to see the soles of my feet? Where they flayed the skin off? You are innocent, I'm sorry. But this bombing is a different matter. Do your work. I'm not going to tell you anything. Then I'm going to hurt you. Dude, can I borrow this? What? Thanks, man. Hey, Hurley, What's what are he you doing? doing? He figured out a game or something. <laughs> she wasn't on the plane. She's dead. Because of me. Being creepy, lady. Creepier than I'm you were so before. Sorry. I want to show you something. To the first and golf? hopefully last island open. You built this. A golf course? All the stuff we gotta deal with, man. This is what you've been wasting your time on? Dudes, listen. Our lives suck. <laughs> Everyone's nerves are stretching the max. I mean, we're lost on an island. Polar Let's bear. have some fun, man. You hear about the polar bear? Look, all I'm saying is if we're stuck here, then just surviving's not gonna cut it. We need some kind of relief, you know? We need some way that we can, you know, have fun. Hurley's right, man. <clears throat> Lost my voice there. <laughs> I could fix it for you. I could take a look at it if you freed my hands. Can you inject him with something? What is written on the back of your photograph? Did she write it? Or did you? You don't need to do that.
Ugh. Can you imagine being stabbed with that nasty needle? Hey! Head up over there! <laughs> Golf? Yeah. Can I play? <laughs> do you want me to fix your music box or don't you? Yes. Yes, please. Then I want to know your name. Danielle. You need to ask her what killed everybody because remember in that stress that distress call? She's saying that it, they killed them all, or it killed them all. So, I need to ask her that question. The message I heard, you said it killed them all. We were coming back from the Black Rock. It was them. They were the carriers. Who were the carriers? The others. What others? What is the Black Rock? Have you seen other people on this island? Out there in the jungle, they whisper. I think you've been alone for too long. Someone at the caves built a golf course. Are you high? Seriously, a golf course. I don't know about you guys, but I'm gonna go check this out. Wait for me, Bonehead. If you wanna come, you should just say. I think I'll pass on that, Freckles. Not big on crowds. And let's face it, the crowd's not too hot on me either. You could change that by being a nice person. I think about making more of an effort. Some things can be fixed. <gasps> Thank you. Thank you so much. You need me. You can't leave. Thank you. Uh, are you elephant? Going? Lucky it's one of the bears. If Monster. There's no such thing as monsters. Now bring her outside and shoot her. Or I will. What did you bring me today? Yes. Don't steal her stuff, man. This down, Daniel. Put it down on the ground. Don't. He's not going to. I mean, I know she dies because he said that she's dead, but. So she wrote it. Whatever it is, I don't know what's written on the back. What are you doing? Dude, what are you gonna do now? Now you have to come with me. They'll kill you. No. You escaped. You stole my gun and you shot him. And then he shot me. So that's how he got the bullet wound. He shot himself. Take it and go. <laughs> no bullets. The firing pin has been removed. Robert didn't notice it was missing either. When I shot him. She killed Robert? He, loved him. he was sick. He took them. One after the other. We had no choice. We were already lost. So there's an illness going around the island? You killed them. I'm not sick. I know. Then why kill me? You don't have to be alone, Daniel. People, the ones you're determined to get back to, watch them. Watch them closely. Explain yourself. Danielle! Who is Alex? Alex was my child. That's what I figured. The sunscreen of flashlight says he chokes. <laughs> Making an effort? I'll take that action. She's trying to help him get yeah. included. Yeah, me too. You just got on Jack, dumbass. We need the 
loves green, princess. Whispering. She said that they whisper. I hear it. Okay, guys, so that is the end of episode 9 of season 1 of Lost. And, um, yeah, this episode was sort of... Okay. Um, we got to see more of Saeed's past. And we got to find out who the girl in the photo is. Her name is Nadia. Who sounds like it, she was a friend of his when they were kids, sort of. I mean, I don't know if they're really friends, but they knew each other when they were kids. Um, she used to pick on him because she liked him and he ignored her. Which is typical kid flirting, basically. <laughs> um, so we get to see that he, you know, tortured people and and everything like that and she's been through it before and she wasn't going to talk so he was ordered to bring her out and kill her um now he said that nadia was dead but when he was talking to danielle uh it sounded like he assumes that she's dead and uh but he doesn't know for sure so i don't know she might be alive uh but yeah, so I mean, we didn't really get to see like the consequences of him shooting his boss, I guess he was. Um, it didn't look like he shot him in a fatal place, but I guess he died. I don't know. Um, and then shot himself to make it look like she killed the guy and then she shot him and then she ran. So those were his uh, bullet scar came from on his leg that Danielle noticed. Um, so yeah, so Danielle seems to be the one who knocks Saeed out and she broke the equipment because she doesn't want to be uh, rescued off the island because of something. It, it's not really clear what it is that she's scared of. It almost sounds like there is an illness going around the island. Um... How she hasn't ended up with it in the last 16 years, I don't know. Um, but she also has a child named Alex, and currently he is missing. I don't know how old he is. I'm going to assume he's either um, a young adult or he's a teenager. Um, because she either brought her kid with her on this trip and then they got stranded here, or she was pregnant had Alex while she was on this island. So, if that's the case, if she had him while she was on the island, he'd be like 16, 15, 16 years old. So, uh, I don't know. I don't know if we'll meet Alex. Or if we'll see Danielle again. I'm assuming we will. Um, but yeah, so, she said that uh, if they were lucky, it was another bear. So, um... I'm kind of scared of what other creature might be out there that's worse than a bear. And uh, she said, she told Saeed that there were no such thing as monsters. So, I don't know. Hopefully we're going to figure out some more mystery um, from this island. You know, just get some answers. Because all we do is just get more questions. And uh, I guess that's the fun, right? So, um, also... Hurley, oh no wait a minute, before I get to that, talk about, Danielle was telling him about that she hasn't seen other people, but she knows they're there, she hears them because they whisper, and he's thinking, you know, she's a little loony, you know, she's been here for 16 years, alone, mostly, and so she's kind of lost it a little bit, which is understandable, um, but at the end there, when he's trying to get back to everybody, uh, he was hearing the whispers. Um, cause I was hearing them, so he was hearing them too, so hopefully he's going to make it back in one piece and nothing's going to happen to him anymore. He's had a kind of a rough time of it the last couple of episodes, um, so yeah. Um, and then there was the thing with Hurley, he was talking to Jack about, you know, everybody's so tense, you know, you know, they need to do something, they need something to do, occupy their time. And Jack's all just worried about making sure everybody's safe, which is a good thing. But like Hurley was saying, you know, you need to be able to have fun because 
who wants to be bored all the time, you know? And I'm bored the majority of my life, so <laughs> I can understand wanting to do something fun. See, like doing this for you guys, this is fun for me. And yeah, it can be stressful when I'm editing and everything and trying to get it out on time, but I enjoy doing this for you guys. And I hope you guys enjoy watching. Um, but yeah, so it's just, I understand Hurley wanting something to do. So he made a golf course and it brought the people together. We saw a bunch of people that we basically haven't seen before. We know that there's a lot of people on the island, like 40 something, um, but we barely see them. But we saw a big group of people and uh, Sawyer joined um, because Kate told him that maybe he should put more of an effort in. And that's what I was saying. He's like, he's like, nobody wants to be around me anyway. And it's like, well, that's your fault. You know, maybe if you were nicer, people will want to be around you. Anyway, she's just like, you know, put an effort in. So he did. And at first, people were not responding to him. And I could see that he was getting ready to just walk away. He's like, whatever. And um, Kate jumped in and she's like, I'll take that bet and all that stuff. So and that got other people to jump in as well. So. It was pretty great. Um, I was happy for that. I mean, I'm not, and you guys know I'm not a Sawyer fan as of right now, but I'm glad that he was trying to make an effort and Kate helped him make that effort um, and didn't let him, like, just give up and leave, you know? So I thought that was great. But yeah, so I enjoyed this episode, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please give this video a like. If you have any suggestions on anything you would like me to react to, please leave that down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.